What's up, YouTube friends? I got a 3D plane I've been working on. Just made a foam board. I'm running the Grayson Hobby GH2217-09. Comes in a little combo kit with four servos, 30 amp ESC. I'm running the Lemon RX 8 channel. I got a 11.1 volt 2200 milliamp lipo. Now I designed this plane from foam board and I didn't even have to use no carbon fiber rod in the wings. But I'll be putting some plans together for this one. It's one powerful little motor on there. Take her up. Kind of just learning how to do any 3D flying. As you can see, I'm getting there. Just afraid to fly low and do it. Sure is a nice flying plane though.
Like I said, I'm not much of a 3D flyer. I'm just kind of learning. I'll go ahead and bring her in. Alright you guys, we put putting some plans together for it. I'm sure you guys that know how to set up 3D planes a little better than me can install a little bit lighter electronics I guess. I know they sell the rim fires and stuff like that. You can see I'm just running one servo for the ailerons. 
our elevator, and our rudder. I tell you guys, I've been bought this Lemon RX receiver. It's a eight channel. It comes with a little satellite receiver too. And you go to LemonRx.com and you can pick them up for like 14 bucks compared to buying any of the Spectrum receivers. And they're just as good, if not better. They're the lightest receivers on the market. And there, like I said, I got an 8 channel and it also comes with a satellite receiver. But alright, I'll get the plans made up for this. And like I said, you won't need no carbon fiber rod. I made this plane with a KF airfoil on the top. So the wings are really stiff, but yet really lightweight. Alright, I'll get back with you over and out.